If you haven't tried Salt and Stone, the best way I could describe it to you is if Bath and Body Works, Le Labo, and ASAP all came together. So they have these body mists. You're buying this if you love Le Labo scent profiles. Rose and Oud, that's Rose 31 Le Labo. The bergamot and Hinoki doesn't take me instantly to a Le Labo, but it's more herbaceous green. I've actually used this extensively as a body wash. What I like about the Salt and Stone body wash is compared to ASAP. Basically, ASAP's fragrance level inside the body wash is pretty Pretty low. Salt and sewn, the lather and the gel is fuller. It's a thicker gel. But you're also getting a higher fragrance load than you do out of ASAP. Not as high as you get out of Bath and Body Works, but the base of the salt and sewn is way more luxury than a Bath and Body Works shower gel. So it feels luxury. Right. They also do deodorants as well. For me, I will say I've used the body washes. I haven't used the body splashes, but in the summer, if you want a lighter weight, easy to wear product like in the Le Labo spirit, check these out.